What's up YouTube view viewers? I went to a garage sale this weekend and I came across this, a box of baseball cards. And as I opened it, I saw this. Now I don't know exactly how many baseball cards are in here, but I'm guessing there's probably a couple hundred. Well, as I go through them, this is what I come across. Bob Gibson, 1964 strikeout leaders, a couple 1960s cards. Harmon Killebrew, 1960 Harmon Killebrew. More 1960s. Uh, 1964 home run leaders, Harmon Killebrew and Mickey Mantle. Uh, 1963. Uh, 1968, um, I don't know what year this is, 1971 Yankees Thurman Munson All-Star Rookie Card, uh, 1970 Ted Williams Manager, 1970 Tom Seaver Pitching Leaders, 64 uh, Pitching Leaders, um, I don't know what year this is, 1960-something uh, uh, Mickey Mantle checklist, a uh, Frank Robinson, 1967 Frank Robinson, uh, 1964 Tony Oliva batting leaders, Brooks Robinson and Easton Howard, uh, another 1964 Harmon Killebrew Mickey Mantle, uh, Frank uh, Howard, um, what, 1971 Reggie Jackson, another 1971 Ted Williams, um, not sure what year that is, Frank Robinson and Brooks Robinson, uh, Whitey Ford, World Series card, another World Series card, Bob Gibson, Al Kings, Lou Brock, um, another 1966 uh, Whitey Ford, 19, I'm guessing 60 something Ted Williams, 1967 uh, batting leaders uh, Bob Clemente, Roberto Clemente, 1975 Mike Schmidt, Reggie Jackson, Reggie Jackson. Sixty-six Sandy Koufax, another sixty-six Sandy Koufax with Bob Gibson, Pete Rose, Pete Rose, all these Pete Roses, Nolan Ryan, Nolan Ryan, Roger Clemens, all these Mark McGuire's, Barry Bonds, Pete Rose, Pete Rose. And uh, let's see, all these Ken Griffey Jr. cards. When I bought the box, all they weren't in the, in the cases. I immediately went to Walmart and bought all these cases to put them in. Frank Thomas, Lance Berkman, the baseball with Mark McGuire, Roger Clemens, and then I also had these few football cards in there. Drew Blitzo rookie card, a Boomer Esiason, Terry Bradshaw, a Buffalo Bills uh, with O.J. Simpson on it, and a Barry Sanders rookie card. And all the rest of them. They range from 1960 to 1970. They were all in this box for 20 bucks. I got the whole box for 20 bucks. Now I know a little bit about baseball cards, but not a whole lot. I'm not really for sure what all these are worth. Don't really care. But I think it's a pretty damn good find.
anybody has any idea of what these are worth, Jim Hunter, Rolly Fingers, let me know. There's got to be a couple hundred in here. All in this box, and the lady wanted 20 bucks for them. I should have tried talking her down. Jim Hunter. She said that her father had passed away and these were all his baseball cards and that she wanted to get rid of them. Didn't know too much about them or anything. I don't know whether to put them on eBay and sell them or, or what. Frank Howard, another Ted Williams card right there. Jim Hunter, Jim Palmer. Don't know really what all these together would be worth. Easton Howard, Al Kane, Mickey Lloyd, true, however you say his name. Frank Howard. But, and the rest of them are 1970s. Jim Hunter, Jim Palmer, Fingers, Frank Howard, another Ted Williams. Just a whole bunch of, all these, all these are 1970s. So if you got any idea what you think they're worth, just give me, send me a message on what you think. I thought it was a pretty good find for 20 bucks. Didn't hesitate to buy them. So, thanks for watching. Just let me know what you think.